Good morning, this is Nick from Pressman Auto doing a video walkthrough of the 2019 GMC Acadia. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk all the way around the vehicle, we're gonna check for any dents, scratches, any blemishes on the outside. Then we're gonna go inside the vehicle, go over some of the features, make sure everything's working properly. And then finally, we'll pop the hood so we can evaluate a little bit in the engine bay. So a couple things to note first of all, um, one, it's raining. <laughs> so <laughs> since it's raining, um, if there are any dents or scratches or anything, I'll be sure to stop and zoom in, make sure you get a good look of it. So um, none, of the, none of the rain on anything will obscure any of the visuals. And second, um, this vehicle actually just barely arrived. Um, so it's kind of in a lineup here against the wall. It's where our new lands go. But we got, it looks like in the shipping, there's a little bit, it got pushed up against something. So we got something there. So we'll be taking care of that either way. But just a couple things to know right off the front. Um, we'll be taking care of that so it'll be nice and perfect right there. But that all being said, let's start going around and see what we can find. So first things first, the front, the front bumper and everything, I'm not really seeing any rock chipping, which you would expect from at least a 2019, but so far it looks really, really good. Let's keep going. All right, tires still have loads of life left in there. Never mind, that's coming off. I thought it was a scratch, but not. it was not. All right, that's coming off too. Nope. All right, never mind. And there's a spot we talked about. All right, yeah, honestly, the exterior looks super perfect. Again, we're gonna be taking care of this since it was you know, done in shipping, it's our bad, so we'll get that fixed, but the outside looks phenomenal. Pop inside. All right. So I'm gonna turn on the vehicle, and when I do, I'm going to leave the camera up here on the dashboard, so if there's any warning lights, anything popping up, you'll be the first to know. So let's check it out. All right, we got one warning light up right now, which is that I'm not wearing my seatbelt, which is correct. So that looks super solid up here. Let's cycle through a couple things. Economy, oil life, full range. Sweet. All right, so everything up there looks super solid. Let's go over some features on the inside real quick. In here, you're going to have your cooled seats, which are really freaking nice. Um, you also have your heated seats, which are nice for when it's raining. The passenger has those as well. Let's make sure the AC is working. Perfect, perfect. Let's make sure the audio is working. I'm gonna turn it on to... No, we're not gonna pair a device right now. <laughs> nice. All right, audio is awesome. As far as the interior goes, um, this one, I don't think it's been detailed yet. So we still have like some random stuff down there, but it actually even still looks brand new. All the leather looks very well taken care of. I'm not really seeing much of wear and tear on anything. Back seats are the same story. Very, very nice. So a couple other things, you're gonna have your systems in here, your drive systems. A little bit more space down here. Plugins, heated steering wheel, pre-collision system, all the fun stuff. So, I mean, 
we could sit here and go over features all day, but for the sake of time, um, we'll probably keep, cut it there. Let's pop the hood, evaluate a little bit in the engine bay, and we'll call that good for now. All right, so just a quick look in the engine bay. Um, I don't know how mechanically inclined you are or aren't, but in either case, you should always look under the hood of the vehicle you're looking to buy. The reason being, even if you don't know a nut from a bolt, you do know what neglect looks like. So if there's like acid buildup all around the battery, there's rust all over the metal pieces, it's a pretty good sign you should ask some more questions. Um, that being said, it's actually looks pretty, really, really solid. Um, all the metal components look very well maintained, very well taken care of. Battery looks new. Um, so, yeah, that's super solid. Um, if you are mechanically inclined, we can go into more details, but we're going to keep this video pretty user-friendly for now. Suffice to say, when you pop the hood of an engine bay, this is exactly what you want to see. So, if there's anything more specific you have questions about or you want to see, just let me know. But as of now, this is your new Acadia.